With all of the FarmBot kits, we've included three other documents. The first is the Getting Started Guide, and this includes information and links to the resources that we've made available for you to be successful with your FarmBot. The first one, and perhaps the most important, is the link to the hardware documentation. It's genesis.farmbot.io for the version 1.2 kits. On the documentation hub, you'll find step-by-step -step assembly instructions, all of these videos, and a complete list of the bill of materials. So you can look at the tech specs of each of the components in FarmBot to learn about it through and through. So you can find CAD models, dimensions, weights, and prices, places where to buy replacements, all of that stuff. Uh, we've also included ways to modify and extend your FarmBot's abilities if you'd like to you know, get into the hacking of your FarmBot. The other main thing that we discuss on this Getting Started Guide is how to become involved with the community. FarmBot is not just a product or a piece of hardware or software. It's also a global community and movement for pushing this technology forward and allowing us all to grow our own food and to grow food for everyone. So we've set up a community forum and also a wiki. The forum is great for brainstorming with other people, getting help, asking questions, and also helping others. The wiki is an awesome spot for you to document your FarmBot build. So if you have developed your own tools or made some cool modifications or figured out interesting ways to use FarmBot, it'd be great if you could share that with the world because then everyone can learn from you and if enough people do that, you can learn from all of them. The last thing is information on how to get help with your FarmBot kit. We're here at support at farmbot.io so you can email us anytime. Uh, but we prefer that you ask questions in the forum because that way when we respond to you, everyone can gain from our response and everyone can learn from the troubleshooting process that we go through together. So we really encourage you to get involved with the community, whether it's on the forum or on the wiki or with the software collaboration on GitHub or submitting changes to the documentation hub itself. Uh, because ultimately that benefits everyone, not just you, not just us, but the entire FarmBot community around the globe. With the version 1.2 kits, we've also included a nice thank you postcard that you can put on your refrigerator at home. So this is detailing you know, what it means to us for you to have supported our small but growing company. So we really appreciate your support as an early adopter and having taken a leap of faith with us as we uh, pushed our first product out into the world. And last, but certainly not least, is the FarmBot sticker pack, so that you can represent FarmBot and talk about the project everywhere you go. Put them on your water bottle, put them on your car, put them on your laptop. We'd love to see your FarmBot stickers out in the world.